got banned? That's crazy. Well, I, I mean, it's not that crazy, to be honest. But I was really hoping it wouldn't be uh, one of my friends getting banned. I wasn't hoping for anyone to get banned, but if someone was to get banned, I was hoping it wouldn't be my uh, my roommate <laughs> or like friend. So let's go check up on Pokey. What do you mean check up on Pokey? Settle down there, parasocial. I'm sure she's doing fine. It's a DMCA strike, not a drone strike. Miss was watching the same thing at the same time they get banned. I think it's because Miss started later. Then Pokey. So the way it works is I think they submit the DMCA takedown. He was earlier. I'm pretty sure Pokey was streaming Avatar before Miss Kiff was today. Chat, why are you telling me things that aren't factually true? Miss Kiff streamed it 30 minutes after Pokey. Yeah. Which I think is the difference. Miss started a couple of weeks ago. Dumbass, are you listening? Are you misstreamed a few days? Guys, are you listening to the words that I'm saying? I'm saying today. The strike happened today. Why are you arguing with me on this? Um, so I think the way it would work is once they discover that streamers are doing it, they would submit the takedown, but because there's a 30 minute gap, I assume the right holder to avatar didn't see Miss Kiff do it. And if Miss Kiff turns it off in time, I'm pretty sure it doesn't like he can dodge a strike like that. Yeah, it's a live strike. There's a difference between um, an offline strike and a live strike. Pokey got a live strike. Will Miz get an offline strike? Probably not if he covered his tracks, but we don't know for sure.
what's the difference uh i'm not sure i know there is a minor difference she was watching flip like i keep telling people Everything I do, the flipping, the audio muting, doesn't really mean anything. And unfortunately, it happened to Pokey. I was hoping if it happened to anyone, it wouldn't be a friend of mine. But I think the problem is that people see what I'm doing and extrapolate it in a situation that doesn't necessarily apply. But even I don't know like what applies or what doesn't. There, it is 100% possible that tomorrow I go live and I get striked for Naruto. She didn't mute the VOD audio. I mean, she didn't have VOD at all. When she was streaming it, I checked today. There was no one. Viacom and Nickelodeon are more adamant. Yes, because one of the original problems with Justin TV, one of the reasons why DMCA was discussed was because of Viacom. Um... So I was really surprised when Mizkif did Avatar and when Pokey did Avatar. Because you don't want to take your chances with a company that has a history of DMCA strike. Uh, that's incredibly risky. I think what happened is she saw Mizkif do it and thought it was okay. And you would assume that, right? But the thing with DMCA is it's very... There are no rules. Some people can do it and not be punished. And other people can do it and get punished. That's the truth of it. They should have banned Miskiff too then. Uh, in a perfect fair world where punishments and liability and legality are all handled correctly yes if they have a problem with pokey streaming it they should have a problem with miskip streaming it but that's not how that's not the reality of the world that's not the reality of how twitch works or how takedowns work it's just like it's literally a dude saying Oh, I saw this stream, and when I was seeing when when I saw this stream, and it was streaming Avatar, I submitted takedown requests. That person could have not seen Mizkif's stream, right? Like it literally just comes down to whether or not some dude somewhere sees it. Uh, I feel I feel bad. For Pokey, for sure. But that's the risk you take, right? I don't think she's like, oh, it's unfair. She knows that she was taking a risk. I think everything's just funny with the way things worked out. Invite her to your stream, but don't show her. That's not allowed. We can't even listen to her. Avatar was a bad move. Yeah, Avatar was risky.
We're watching Avatar, Ms. Bannon, and Cone, probably. I doubt it. Might be a permanent ban. Her account was deleted. No, all accounts are removed even during temporary bans. Uh, might she jump to YouTube and get the bag? What? What logic is that? <laughs> DMC on YouTube is even stricter. <laughs> 